Hi, welcome. I am on a computer that's not mine, but you probably recognize the feeling of what I'm doing is that every computer should have Arch Linux, right? So this is not mine, but it's from time to time free and then it is my computer. And this is specific because this has a GeForce GTX 970 and it's running the driver of NVIDIA 440 82 and I do know people get stuck updating so I do hope I get stuck at some point in time it all depends my guess is that the Linux kernel and the Nvidia kernel should match and if one of them is not synced out of sync right then you get a kernel with a newer version of Nvidia and or an older kernel with a newer one or well did not say that properly I think so again an older kernel with a newer Nvidia or an older Nvidia with a newer kernel right out of sync I think that's probably the reason why people get stuck and then they have this black screen and um, well this is an update video so this is Arch Linux starting with the Arch Linux um, ISO it's been around it's been around I believe there was a better way to show that what was it again all these switches so um, you can ask for men or you can ask for help or uh, slash uh, minus minus help or minus H I suppose it's um, full times capital F that's the one I want so I see also the years so this is a computer of January 2020 I've been updating all these time and Nvidia gave me no problem whatsoever and last time was June 13th we're now July 2nd all right update it is all right Arch Linux does not know our alias minus s y y u getting in all the libraries and getting in a few packages so it's never for the faint of heart but do check out the last line that's the only thing that changes 32 megabytes but doesn't it, it is it is a lot of things to download so if you have a low um, budget internet connection or anything like it or a slow internet connection another problem then maybe um, you update once in a while once in a month maybe because yeah it just is a problem for you specifically then I see here some Nvidia coming in for 40 so reference numbers I don't know if we are fast enough to ask for the current minus Q Nvidia so that's the version now I, th I, I think I saw number 100 up there so we're jumping from 82 to 100 somewhere I just saw it must be in here it's not alphabetically it would be nice if it were it's not 100% alphabetically 101 so that's the one we want 102 that's the one 100 so that's cool I guess this is 100% alphabetical but when we're building our Arch ISO or our Arch Linux ISOs it never is you have to scroll and look all right so the thing is updating simple as that so the pacman minus s y or y u different possibilities man pacman read hey oh never installed the man command uh, let's see what that would be sudo pacman minus s we have that always on our Linux man something man db or man pages I'm not sure okay locked 
So you can't install in two screens, right? It's just one uh, guy that rules the, uh, rules the installation and now uh, it puts there a dbay.log. Actually never went to look what's inside of it. I don't think there is anything inside it, but just out of curiosity, I had a what if. <laughs> That's everything. Well, nothing at all. Error, permission denied. That's something else. So, pseudo. Well, stays the same, nothing. All right, that's done. Let's install that guy. And now we can read mendb. So, what is s, what is syncing? So, s is syncing and so on. Um, there is more information about upgrades applied to s and u overwrite query things read 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 it's all in your computer actually people always look on the internet and google things but with a pacman minus h never done that voila oh yeah did that so you get already you get already some help right um there is the man pacman and so on the man compton and so on every package normally the developer provides something but in this case in a arch linux brand new installation well one of six months old old right and never installed the man db thing uh, so go back minus s man and then something the man db i wonder what the man pages is Do not know everything that is the proof all right so the system is up to date do i have yay installed on this arch linux thing yay are you there yay is installed minus s y u if i do this and anything that's coming from the aor will be checked as well and there is nothing from the aor there are packages gone so packages that do not exist anymore so we can remove even to eventually with dependencies uh, xorg no dependencies that are not needed did i make a typo i can't auto complete oh yeah i can cool so that's gone if i redo it that's one thing less and the missing aor packages arc linux spices git you know that's the application we use to get the arc linux things in so when we do Update doesn't exist, Eric. So you go back to minus s y u. Let's have a look. Did not check. Yeah, we have our repos in here. So anything I would like to install that's built, pre-built on um, our repo, I can get. Like, for instance, you go back to minus s Spotify. Right. This is straight from our. Um, github well yep correct github but um we can't see it actually it's just reinstalling it's not saying anything uh, yay spotify maybe we should can show you that way here it is so we have arco linux extra large spotify it's coming from there and for the guys who are working on tiling window managers you can install Spotify WM Git, which makes it easier to have a class name. They know what I'm talking about, Xprop and class names. So you can say to the Spotify window, go to Workspace 10, uh, stay there. That's what you need. All right, uh, not much to tell anymore. I mean, uh, I hate the wallpaper, it sucks really. Um, but, um, oh yeah, it was this little icon here next so lots of more icons actually it was a good one so previous there we go it's a nice look and we're back up to date and i will reboot of course you won't see that i will reboot and um, then we will see if nvidia and curl and all are synced all right cheers